Hello everyone, and I'm gonna now try and make more of an effort to post, and I know I've been saying that for a while, but I really, really like doing YouTube, and it's a bit annoying that every time I want to upload a video that something comes up, or I'm busy, or, and I just forget about it, and then I forget for ages, and then I'm like, oh yeah, I still have a YouTube channel, but I'm actually gonna try and make more of an effort to post, because I like doing this, and I think that I've left YouTube for long enough to realize how much I miss doing it because that's the another reason why I stopped doing YouTube for a bit because I wanted to see if I actually missed uploading and I didn't like forcing myself to upload but I actually do miss uploading um, so I'm here today with a new video and if you haven't watched my last video a bunch of the comments on that video were asking me to talk about and do an unboxing of the Doors Perception box set which is what I'm going to do today I had a lot of comments asking about that box set so I thought I would talk about that now. If you haven't already, subscribe to my channel and I still have merch. I keep forgetting to bring up the merch in the video, but I do have merch and it's always in the link down in the description. So if you would like your very own Progno t-shirt, here are some designs. I love them so much. Please check them out. And let's get on with the unboxing. So here is the box set oh, in question. It's kind of the wrong way around, but um, this is the box set. That is the spine, and something very cool about this is, I don't know if you'll be able to see this on the camera, um, but the photos change, it's, 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 you look inside and there's pictures of the band and pictures of Jim Morrison, and it's very cool, because I guess perception, and it just opens out, like so, kind of like a book, or like a wardrobe, it's kind of cool, um, and we've got the albums in here, so, the reason why I love this box set so much is because not only does it come with the original album, but it also comes with like bonus tracks, demos, and I think a Blu-ray as well. So if you like your Blu-ray audio, or I don't know if this is Blu-ray audio, this could just be DVD audio, but if you like your DVD audio, Blu-ray audio, whatever, then this will be for you. So I'll just run through each album in order. So we have the first Doors album, the self-titled, and they open up like that. I really like the inside packaging. Uh, I'm not really a big fan of them being in the slots without like a protective cover because I'm always worried about scratching my CDs. And each of them does come with a booklet about the album inside. So I'll show this one and I won't show the other ones. Um, so it's just photos, lyrics, whatever you need to know about uh, each album that or about the album in question that you were looking at the next one is my personal favorite doors album strange days again opens out like so with the original label inside and the dvd audio obviously then we have waiting for the sun i think there's some live versions on here as well i think i might have already mentioned that but there's some lyrics in there as well the Soft Parade, I think this is the only Doors album that I've actually not listened to yet. So let me know your thoughts and feelings on this album in the comments, if you've listened to it. Then we have Morrison Hotel. And last but not least, LA Woman. The Doors are one of the very few bands that I know that um, their last album is generally considered their best album. I don't really know many other bands where that's the case, um, but it is a great album. This is one of the first albums I got in my uh, record collection when we were starting out collecting vinyl. Um, LA Woman was one of the first albums we got in the first batch of albums that we bought. Or, and. Um, I'm, I'm thinking of doing a video about that at some point, about the first albums that I ever got in the collection, because it'll be interesting to see where I've come since then. Because my music change has drastically changed since I first got my record collection. Actually, quite a lot. It's changed a lot. Um, I was really into, like, like emo music. Uh, like, hardcore, metalcore kind of music. Um, and then I got more into classic rock and then from then on I was into things like metal and stuff like that. My music taste changed quite um, significantly in that period of time. 
So that is the end of the video. Do you have this box set? Let me know if you do. Um, as I said, I'm going to try and upload more this week at some point. It's just trying. To, I'm just trying to figure out what to upload because there's only so many unboxings that I can do to the point where people want to see something different. Um, and I want to post something different. So let me know what kind of content you want to see in this new year. I am open to any suggestions that you may have. And I will see you all in the next video. Bye-bye.